Ted Kenya. Nasikia leo tuko hapa kwa ajili ya Zone 69 magazine ambayo ya kwanza nataka nashukuru sana media ya uh, Kenya online media nikianza na Don uh, Don TV uh, Sunset Kenya uh, na White Media pamoja na Shift Shift Media mzua kibao Sunset Kenya uh, pamoja na hiyo nyingine sijapata jina lakini <laughs> credit yako iko guaranteed. Ah siku leo tulikuwa na launch magazine na vile mmeona kwa hizo clips zimepita hapo nyuma tulikuwa na launch magazine na tunashukuru sana. Yeah. Na Asante. labda ulia muadza diko na uanzishe mambo ya kama hizi na tuna tuna join mtu wetu wa YouTube tunafanya hivi <laughs> mambo mengine. Unasikia kinaita challenge you know you, you challenge yourself each and every day kwa sababu unaona kuna media kubwa kubwa sana sio TV peke yake unaona wako na radio wako na magazine sasa kitu gani za tuzuia sisi kufanya vitu kama hizi yeah uh, na mbona uliamua kuita Tunzi 69 na kuna mziki kibao zone 69 kuna kibao hapo utakata anyway hii daily so kuna tofauti ya nation na daily ndio so that's what we have here we have zone 69 we have tons we have msuka kibao we have sunset and we have all around africa yeah tunataka tu hizo jina zikuwe tofauti sichanganye watu kwamba kuna tons kuna nini kwa like kitu kimoja okay. yes mm. so uh, gazeti zingine watu tunaona zinatoka kila siku kuna gazeti mm-hmm. so yako tuna itakuwa inatoka daily kama zingine au itakuwa inatoka kwa muda gani mm-hmm. um, for zone 69 tulionelea kwamba itoke monthly because tunataka kufanya an in-depth coverage na ukiangalia space yenye pia tuna, tunataka kuchukua ni all around Africa now with that inamaanisha kuget hizo content zote pamoja na tuwapatie kitu mzuri kitu yenye iko miti with the very very good content ina to take time mob that's why tumeona tu itakuanga monthly na will you focus na entertainment ama ni kila news yoyote ya hiyo politics anything ama itakuwa ni entertainment peke yake actually based on audience ile yenye tuna target tunajaribu ku bring content yenye ina enrich life life ya our readers that means that if politics happens to be kitu ya interest kwao then tunaweza cover but for the first issue tume major on uh, health entertainment then interview with a couple of artists here and there but there's a special segment for business on the capital zone mali young entrepreneurs one as i get ideas and insights on how to actually start and run a business because also uki consider that uh, easy brand zote unaona hapa psc we are trying to to manage something we are trying to create something big out of the real truth that we have so how do we share that information with the other aspiring business entrepreneurs who in the pia wapate idea how to manage and start their own thing so kuna hiyo segment ya biz na it's a very very special place where people can get ideas on how to run their own businesses so oh, for, for someone to appear maybe kwa nieno uh, kama msanii hmm. kama the you know young business entrepreneurs yes uh, do they have to pay ama it's uh, something that is open for every man tuma kitu oje alisha sema tu na yakutoa pia nini but for the no. for the first three issues tuma kwamba want to give it out for free mm-hmm. yeah itakuwa free everything uh, watu ambao wanataka kwa future wako future ndani wasanii mm-hmm. kila mtu itakuwa free mpaka kuipata itakuwa free mm-hmm. kuna website ambayo tume tumetengeza jana ambayo mm-hmm. itakuwa exclusive kwa zone69.com uh, zone69magazine.com so kama mtu ana, ana, anataka kuwa rich tu ana ana rich and content yake kwa yeah yeah kwa hapo ya sure inaonekana mimi kwa kuwa na hizo na na magazine challenges zimekuwa gani uh, safari ya ku kufanya hiyo magazine baada ya kufika kutoka okay i think we'll have to answer that to of us i'll start with myself <laughs> <laughs> on my side first of all getting the word uh, the name Zone 69 was not easy kwa sababu mm-hmm. unaona okay, okay unatafuta jina brand una search unaona ah iko unaona so kwa nataka tukue na kitu unique mm-hmm. so hii stuff ili kwa hivi we have to contact a lot of people we but nashukuru jamaa ambaye anaitwa Battles Music kwa sababu tulishare na yeye some of the names tulikuwa nayo kasema no yeah, yeah. 
Unaona? So ndio karudi chini. Tukapata tuka kitu naita zone. So like okay is on what next tuko na zone magazine kusaidia zone magazine zone iko so tukakuwa like okay the day uh, nilikuwa na hiyo idea ya, ya, ya magazine hmm. ilikuwa tarehe 9 mwezi wa 6 mwaka huu unaona so utaona like six <laughs> month iko kwanza then the day so on my side hiyo uh, pia nimekuwa challenge then challenge kwaana ni ku get content and then ajua tulikuwa tume relax kwaana like okay time bado time bado so kufika jana unaona like tuko na content kidogo magazine atuja nini naona so like uh, for now sijalala jalala but now magazine iko tayari and it's uh, everything is uh, ready for tomorrow what we put here yeah so maybe on his side abetoa siri ya mali 69 imetoka but ni sawa hiyo ilikuwa ibaki ibaki in house so, uh, but at least mmeona like saa zingine kupata the winning idea it's not something far fetched ni kitu tu iko around for example how we came up with the 69 you know night it was a simple concept just based on the date eh? anything yenye iko with a, a collaborative effort lazima kukuangea na challenge ya ku bring the entire team together you know so that's another thing that we had uh, a bit of a struggle with based on uh, ukisoma hii gazeti hii magazine utapata kuna contributors from as far as Ghana West Africa as unajua getting all these guys together first to share the vision then to also implement it alafu as an editor the main challenge is always harmonizing the various stories so that it can be a flowing idea from one end to the next to the next you know and also based that it was the first issue of course layout and everything was a bit of uh, tricky but now that we have the template we know the the forthcoming issues zitakwanga a bit of uh, an easy work it's a dream uh, mimi kulala kwangu when rafiki yangu most of the time tuna chat late sana so uh, kulala kwangu na kwa ngumu because uh, this is a life i choose ni life ndo nataka niishi unaona so mpaka tu nijitolee kuifanya unaona na pia kuna watu ambao tunafanya nao wananisaidia unaona yeah so like siko peke yangu ku manage na i manage la but eh, kuna vitu usifanyi mimi kuna watu ambao wanasaidia kuzifanya some few years to come to tell you kuna zone 69 ki wapi is not only not only zone 69 all these brands eh uh, <laughs> okay, it uh, is uh, Zone 69. Like today, let's say it's a um, um, birthday for Zone 69. Yes. Which means it's a receipt. That's fine. Mm -hmm. So to launch it, to put ideas on 69, to launch it, to launch it, to launch it, that's fine. Um, so in two years' time, or one year time, not to tulikuwa na issue idea issue ngapi for only four issues eh? mm -hmm. four, four issues peke yake i think mkikuja mnataka hype mta will have to pay millions of money but for now <laughs> thank you so much <laughs> so ni kitu ambaye ina, inaenda ki grow mm -hmm. the fourth issue you will come and witness kwamba okay wandiga you said this na imefanyika imejafanyika cause our main target is africa not kenya unaona yeah not kenya so like uh, we have hata uh, vile amesema kwamba tuko na waandishi amesahau ku mention uganda tuko na waandishi yes. uganda mm. tuko na gana kuna wale watu wa nigeria waja submit because uh, time unaona time kwa chini but uh, so the pages we have we have 26 pages whereby tunashukuru sana the the KOM the Kenya online media pia wako na specific page yao whereby yeah amazing uh, what if mimi tuseme mimi mwandishi nataka <laughs> ku join on 69 ukwe mwandishi pia <laughs> Uh, for now, you know, when you share a dream, you share. At a the lizard you have guess. Because as I say, I couldn't have to share here. The, the people are like, to share, you know, share there, zone 69, zone 69. Mm -hmm. eh? So, you know, hey, can I give an article? So, like, okay, it's fine. No, no. So, so, like, at a year business, I'm a same, uh, your, your capital zone, eh? capital zone, a busy zone. Eh? Yes. You may like three days ago. Jamal, in the people, bro, and attack and you article pale. Na kandika over na soko tuma atu kugo through the atu like this the, this is what we were missing. No no. Yeah. Maybe pia just to add on it ni we tuma tuma content yako then we see whatever you have and verify kama ni kitu in enda nishana na malengo yetu we can always always give you space you know unatuma tu content yako. 
na tuna tunajua magazeti magazeti zingine huwa zinatoa soft copy so that watu wengine wenye hawa yuko kwa mtandao wanaweza pata so nyinyi mna mna plans gani kwa watu wenye hawatumii sana mitandao uh, i think our main target ni watu ambao wako mtandao ndio watu wa daily wako online unajua ma updates vile ziko that's why the the first four issues tuna cause ndio nimekuomba kwamba ikifika the fourth issue itakuwa another business but for now uh, online dot kwa like is the best place ya kuiuza kwa sababu ni Africa you can't distribute a magazine from Kenya upeleke 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 Togo upeleke Egypt unaona so like ukitumia the soft copy version which is pdf or the nini the doc version itakuwa rahisi sana kuafikia yeah so uh, labda labda swali la mwisho ni tunajua sana sana mtu akianzisha uh, kitu kweli most of the time tunakonga tunakimbilia sponsors tunakuwa tunakimbilia nani labda ni mnamfadhili huko nyuma ambaye na anawasaidia ku Mm. sponsor ni sisi sponsor, <laughs> sponsor, <laughs> sponsor, ni, sponsor ni sisi yes, na Mungu na nyinyi ndio umetu sponsor mm. uh, East Africa Africa mali iko yeah, ya labda before tumalize anaweza mention maybe names the wale, wale watu ambao labda ume contribute one way or the other kwa e, is on 69 magazine na usisahau yeah. KO <laughs> <laughs> oh yes by the way like uh, <laughs> <laughs> Tuweze tu na KOM kwanza tuwashukuru sana for everything that you've done and for making this happen. Uh, our technical editor Elvis Zengo, our operational editor Jacob Utieno. We have contributors Valentine Singer who is contributing on the sport section. We have Joy who is Shiko Gitau contributing on health. We have Modi our West African contributor and we have uh, Brian Tony Brian Tony is our West African contributor no, 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 and Tony is from Uganda, from Uganda. Yeah, okay actually ukiangalia magazine ukiona chat up here chat uh, top 10 eh? yeah. imetoka Uganda sio oh, sisi okay <laughs> <laughs> so Brian Tony from Uganda and Modi from Ghana right Ghana yeah yes and then we have um, Mugendi Mugendi yeah. Mugendi is our business contributor also yeah. and uh, For now just that and of course me holy rights. Yeah. It's the chief Thank editor. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. And but uh, kuna mtu uko na swali la mwisho? Maybe we just show you the front page. Mm-hmm. This is the f- the front page for Zone 69. Mm-hmm. The person who is featured here and it's Black Cinderella kwa wale watu ambao umewatch um, Nairobi Diary unaweza yeah. uh, kufamilia na yeye. Mm-hmm. Yeah so uh, yeye ndo tunaona like uh, she's the perfect person kwa kufuta the first first issue of Zone 69 magazine yeah. maana tulikuwa na idea ya wasanii tukona like tume feature wasani, uh, stores za wasanii wengi sana so like weka msanii mmoja chagua mtu mwingine kama Vera mbona black 60 na black Unajua <laughs> we have a Black Cinderella. Okay, this is the story of Black Cinderella. <laughs> that's good. That's good. So you see the same way Pia Venye si tumekuwa na dream for Zone 69 is the same way Pia Black Cinderella amekuwa na dream. Cuz uki check story yake, she is an actress, a TV personality, social media activist. Uh, she is also a, a political aspirant so, yeah, you know okay soon mtamwona kwenye ballot yeah so huyu <laughs> ni mtu ana try ku motivate youth to go out of their way and do the most they can if you trace back the the the, the, the story and the questions that is also symbolic of our ceo isaiah who is doing the most he can so that's how his story bills zilikuja zikafanya nini zika fall into place and just to give you another secret day uliuliza kwa nini ya isa how isa ana manage ku mane, run all these brands yeah. the secret ni huyu mtu wako na na bed ku ofisi yake so he doesn't sleep <laughs> he works all night <laughs> okay thank you so much na mjini langu naitwa Omache kutoka TNG Media KE na swali langu uh, tunajua kwamba wakati mtu unaanzisha kitu kuna zile vitu ambazo unazingatia labda kuna mtu ambaye tukitoka hapa online media atakuwa ametazama interview na amepata kujifunza kitu fulani na akasema kwamba anataka kuanzisha magazine ama kuanzisha brand yake labda vitu viwili ambavyo mnamweza kumweleza ama kumwambia aweze kuzingatia ni gani i think on my side kitu kwanza ni muhimu ni prayer 
uko na idea you pray about it kwamba niko na idea kuanzisha magazine the first thing you go ni anize you pray unaona unaomba Mzee Mungu so ya pili is kwamba kufanya kitu each and every day usikopi mtu fanya kitu original uko na idea uko na uko na idea ya kuanzisha youtube channels ndio what are you going to do there unaona usifanye kitu kwamba at media fly nafanya the same you want also you also want to do the same unaona ukiona hizi vitu hizo vitu ukiangalia hata youtube huwa unaweza fanya like zimelala si hata zidalala unaona because tunataka original content tunataka vitu vitu nzuri kwa kwa, kwa kwa fans unaona so wakati tunaanzisha brand uh, mtu kwanza ni customer atataka nini ni kama kuuza nyanya pale kitu gani nita convince mtu asinunua nyanya kwangu mm-hmm. anyonyewe anunue kwa hole mm-hmm. na nyanya ni the same Nona. so hiyo pia unaangalia kwamba okay nyanya lazima ziwe tofauti alafu pia pili pia ni discipline discipline wewe bina, wewe binafsi una discipline mm-hmm. na watu pia wanafanya nao na watu ambao wana kusurround yeah mm-hmm. labda si swali la mwisho mm-hmm. na ningeweza kuuliza ni kitu gani ambacho kabisa kama nyinyi mnaogopa kabisa kikisije kikatokea <laughs> kwa zona 69 magazine <laughs> okay mimi kwangu kitu anaogopa sana ni kifo <laughs> yani anyone in uh, in this house mtu wote ambaye anahusika sana asife hiyo ndio kitu tunaogopa but hizo vitu zingine vitu normal ya kifo ndio mazee so i just imagine mimi nitumie mimi nimekufa unaona so tunaona hii mimi ndio hakuna mtu anajua password ya hila <laughs> so hawatapata <I> access <laughs> so hiyo ndio vitu mimi naogopa kifo yeah, na tunaogopa Mungu pia tunaogopa kifo na Mungu yeah sana. Nashukuru sana pia. Nashukuru sana. sana mambarikiwe zaidi na zaidi. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah.